Hi everyone! I recently purchased some items from the MAC Posh Paradise collection and I thought that I would go through my collection to see if I had any items that looked similar. So some of the items in this collection I think are pretty unique and really don't have dupes. They have similar things out there, but they're worth, I think, going out and picking up. So if you're interested in finding possible dupes for items in Max Posh Paradise collection, then please keep watching. First we'll do the Mateen lipsticks, and we'll start with Eden Rouge, which is pretty much a true red. And it's this long swatch right here in the middle. And we'll start comparing it with this right here, which is Revlon's Love That Red. And as you can see, it's much more orange than the Eden Rouge. The next swatch is right here, and this is Sephora's Ultra Vinyl Lip Pencil in O2 Fancy Red. And it's much more blue-based, but even if it were the same shade, this has the complete opposite finish. This is an ultra glossy pencil, and this is a semi-matte finish. But either way, they're not the same color anyway. And then we've got right here Maybelline's Cherry Red. And it's not exactly the same as Eden Rouge, it's a little more of a bright red. So I don't have an exact dupe in my collection of Eden Rouge, but if I had to pick out of the ones I just showed you, it would be Maybelline's Cherry Red. The next item is the Unknown Pleasures lipstick. And it looks much more brown in the tube, but it's really a nice wine shade. It's this swatch right here, the long one in the middle. If you do, now this is very buildable, so if you do a single coat of this, it looks a lot more bright, but I don't want it to be bright. I like, I like to wear it a little on the darker side. So this is Unknown Pleasures right here, this long swatch, and we will start right here, and this is YSL's 09 Rose Stiletto, and as you can see, it's much more pink-based, and it's got more of a shiny finish. Then right here is MAC Wild About You, which came out a long time ago, but it's much more of a magenta color than a, than a brown. It's, it's much more magenta. Next is this one right here, which is similar, but a little too brown. This is Revlon's Raisin Rage. So it's similar but a little darker and a little more brown based. Then this one right here is much too glossy and much too pink and this is Lancome's Curtain Call. This is probably the closest that I have and this is Sephora's R02 lipstick, although it is slightly more red based, but it is fairly similar. Out of all of the swatches that I have, I would probably say the closest to Unknown Pleasures is either Revlon's Raisin Rage, which is just a little more brown, or Sephora's R02 lipstick, which is just a little more red. The last Mateen lipstick is Deliciously Forbidden, which is a beautiful blue-pink berry. And it's this longer swatch right here. And we'll start right here. This is YSL's number 09 Rose Stiletto, and I think that's really similar. It might be just a tiny bit lighter. It's definitely not as dark as Deliciously Forbidden, which is here, but this YSL Rose Stiletto is similar if you can't get your hands on it. Although it's definitely more expensive, so if you're looking for an alternative, in terms of price it's not worth it, but if you're just checking your collection for similar things, it is pretty similar. This next one is not even close and this is Josie Marin's Argon Color Stick in Rosie and as you can see it is so much more orange and lighter. Definitely not close. Next is right here and this is Lancome's Curtain Call and it's a sheen lipstick and it's similar but the the finish is quite different. The Deliciously Forbidden is a semi-matte and Curtain Call is a sheen so it's much more glossy looking. But aside from the glossiness, they're actually really similar in tone. So this, I mean, Deliciously Forbidden might be a tiny bit more pink, but Curtain Call is pretty close. 
Then this shade right here is completely different. I know it's not even, this is a lip gloss, it's not even remotely similar in terms of finish, but it's somewhat close in color. And this is the Josie Marin Argon Natural Volume Lip Gloss in Voluptuous. So, yeah, I don't even know why I put that on there, honestly, because it's not even close. It's a gloss, which defeats the purpose of a semi-matte finish. And then this color down here is MAC Wild About You, and it is much more purple and a little darker, but I do love this color. I wish they would come out with it in the collection again. But it is, yeah, so that's not even close. Now the closest contenders that I would say would be Lancome Curtain Call, although that is a sheen, so the finish isn't even remotely similar, or this YSL Rose Stiletto, which is a little bit more on the lighter pink side, but it is similar, and quite pretty.